hey guys welcome back to another exciting video so today we are going to try out a new custom rom on our redmi note 8 so today we have project matrix rom based from android 14 so i did use project matrix rom on my redmi note 6 pro but not on my redmi note 8 so let's find out how impressive this rom is <music> So the ROM is booted up. So let's check uh, Android version and security patch level as we always do. So yes, let's settings about phone and the UI is very beautiful. As you can see here, we have all the details like our processor, display resolution, storage and RAM and also the battery. So if I go here, Android version. So as you can see, project metrics and this this one is a gfs build so there is a vanilla build and gfs build i flashed the gfs build as you can see and the version of the rom is 10.4.2 android version 14 and the security patch level is april 5th 2024 it is a new build going back the setting is a little bit different than aosp based rom this one is also based on aosp but the setting has a different look so it does look beautiful actually i really like the way it looks uh, yes we have few features here and everything is working completely fine if you go to network and internet section as you can see the icons and everything looks very beautiful and network section has no issue i haven't found anything like that everything is working fine going to the display section we do have all the functions like adaptive brightness extra dim lock skin and everything whatever we get with android 14 based rom all those things are available here double tap to work double tap to sleep does work perfectly fine no issue so double tap double tap working perfectly fine no issue with those things and going back sound and vibration working perfectly fine the ui is really beautiful on this rom actually and wallpaper and style we do have all the functions here so if i go to change wallpaper maybe we don't have like ai wallpaper so as you can see we don't have ai wallpaper option but rather than that everything is there so more lock screen option we do have few things ambient display only works when someone send you messages or anything like that it will just light up and with the dark background so that's it there is not really aod support and going back there is like security and privacy so security and privacy fingerprint and face unlocks both are available and both of them are working perfectly fine yes like face unlock is a little bit slow but fingerprint does work perfectly fine no issue let me show you the face unlock too so as you can see it's slow but does work perfectly fine no issue but fingerprint is super fast no issue with that rather than that there is nothing new here everything is very similar to all the roms so we do have Xiaomi parts option here and you can change or calibrate your display according to your liking so you can do that too rather than that there is nothing new here about the battery the battery is doing pretty well battery backup is pretty good on this ROM actually I have been using many days now it's working perfectly fine yes you are not getting few features which are available on Evolution X ROM like uh, you don't have any kind of ampere control here so you can't do that but we do have like a charging control up to the limit so you can set the limit i select it 85 percent or also you can schedule or custom schedule it's up to you so these functions are available and better aesthetics it does look pretty beautiful actually and works perfectly fine there is nothing new here everything's perfectly working and if you go to metric setting there are tons of setting you can play with all the uh, features are available you can change it however you like so i will not go on into them actually rather than that there is nothing new going on here yes uh, it's a gfs build so all the gfs are included here and it did not come with any kind of miui camera the camera app it came with it's this camera which is maybe gcam go it does work perfectly fine as you can see here uh, it's work perfectly fine and i did install the gcam i usually use on my device so i did install that and it is working perfectly fine no issue as you can see here so gcam is also working perfectly fine and if you 
thinking about safety net safety net is passed so you can use bank application here as you can see so everything is working perfectly fine the only issue i have found with this rom actually is that is a little bit sluggish it's not really that fast like evolution x and also you are missing miui camera rather than that there is no issue with this rom actually it's a perfectly usable rom no issue with that you can use bank application the rom is performing very well no bug or anything like that but still i would prefer evolution x over this rom evolution x is much better rom than this because faster rom and it works very well so that's all about project matrix rom for readme note 8 i will put the rom link in the description below if you want to flash you can flash it so that's all about it thank you very much for watching and i will catch you in the next one